We're joined now by Charles Smith, he of K Vintners. He's just won an extremely prestigious award, that is the Wine Enthusiasts Winemaker of the Year. Charles, welcome. Thank you. It's good to be here. It is a prestigious award, isn't it? I believe so. Yeah. They're Global saying you're the best in the world, right? This year, I guess I'm the best winemaker in the world, according to the wine enthusiasts. That's it. Well, congratulations. We'd like to have successful people on the program. Yeah, I was very happy, very honored for the award. Now, uh, I've got to ask you a question. Sure. This wine here. It's a Riesling, correct? Correct. And you've called it Kung Fu Girl Riesling. Right. Now, I'm sorry. Why on earth would you call a world-class wine Kung Fu Girl? I want to use the found term, and I want to communicate the language of wine in modern terms. I mean, we're not a wine culture as a country. So the idea is I think Kung Fu Girl tells a new world wine story, and my wine is from the new world. But you're selling to millennials, really, aren't you? You're trying to I sell to. I, I have people that write me that are like in their 70s and say it's their favorite wine. So the idea is about I'm a classic winemaker with a modern packaging. But in my day, and in Liz McDonald's day too, I do believe, it was Chateau Lafitte or Chateau Margaux. I don't, well. Had a certain cachet to it. Kung Fu Girl Riesling? We're going to have that and Chateau Margaux for lunch today. <laughs> oh, you are now. <laughs> Why not? They belong on the same well, table. Listen, there's skinny girl vodka, so, you know, I think you are into something. Exactly. Well, um, how many cases a year do you produce? Of well, the Kung Fu Girl, people? for example, in 1999, I started with $5,000 and 87 Chevy Astro van, and I made 330 cases of wine. Now I'm the largest independent producer of wine and winemaker-owned winery in Washington State. This year, all in total, I'll make 750,000 cases of wine, which is just a little over 9 million bottles of wine. Are you privately wow. owned? Yeah, I own it myself. You're 100% owner? And debt-free. And debt-free. A debt free. Yes. Would you care to sell out for any amount of money? <laughs> now, for any, would you sell your dream? This is my dream. And oh, I'd I sell do. my dream for hundred for hundred million dollars. <laughs> would you sell your winery for hundred million dollars? You got a hundred million dollars, give me. I'll take it. You would. <laughs> no, no, no. Wouldn't you? No, I would never sell my dream. This is what I do. Of of all the wines you produce, and you've got uh, Syrah, you've got uh, the Riesling. You, across the board here. Right. What's your personal favorite? I like making uh, traditional style wine, which is what I do and everything, but I'm known for making single vineyard, uh, whole, whole cluster, 100% native yeast, pure Syrah. Syrah, that's your big one. That's what I really Can I make. buy that all across the country? Yeah, yeah the Cave Vintners ones you can buy across the country in very limited amounts. I have 15,000 people on my mailing list. I have a sold out wine club. This is, I, hold on a second. This is the Syrah. This is Syrah, single vineyard. If, you, if I want to buy one bottle of this, how much? $25. $25. And you put out 750,000 cases a year. Of everything I do total, not just that. If I did that, that would be I'm trying to figure awesome. out. Gross, gross revenues are in the, in the neighborhood of $10 million. My, my, business, my, my business is over $40 million a year. $40, 40 million a year? Mm -hmm. That's gross revenues? Gross revenue. What's your margin? Pretty damn good. <laughs> <laughs> 100% owned by you, yes. one Charles Smith. Exactly, hair and all. <laughs> <laughs> is that deliberate? Because you want to be entertaining? No, I've just always been myself. The idea is, you know, stay true to yourself. And the thing is, in that way, the communication is direct and pure. And I never uh, waver on the message. The message is, I'm a classic winemaker, and I make wine, and, and I put it in modern packaging for the times. This is you where we are. Drink wine every day? I do every day. Do you swallow it, or do you just? Spit it out. Oh, no. I swallow it. Swallow it. <laughs> I swallowed a fair, a fair amount of it yesterday. It's fat bottle a day or two bottles a day? It depends on which day it is. But today is what? It's Monday. Oh, this is two bottle day. <laughs> <laughs> All right. He's an honest man. Charles Smith, K Vintners, thank you very much. Pleasure. Great to, to see have you. you with. Thank Good you so much. Now. Okay.